Hey guys, so today I am going to tell you a big life change. I have decided to quit my job. Now I actually have two jobs. I own a law firm, LUS, U-L-U-S, and I own a marketing agency, RunRex, and both of them have done incredibly well over the last 11 years. I've worked 60, 80 hours almost every single week. I have not had much time or any time off because when you are a vendor and that's what these businesses, people, clients hire us as vendors, you don't get vacation days. What I do in marketing is called pay-per-click. So when there is a vacation day, like a Christmas holiday, that's when we had to change out ads. We had to do so much more um, than you would ever imagine on that particular day. So back to the reason I'm making this video, I am going to take some time off. It's been 11 years since I've taken a single day off, something like that. Now, there are days I was like too sick to work, right? But like a vacation day. Uh, as you guys know, recently I've been in a serious relationship. I have a child baby, Farina. And people still in the comment section, the, the Meta Zoo crowd thinks that the baby is fake, which is crazy since he has 20,000 point seven subscribers so she has her own youtube channel it's going really well see oh yeah she has 20.7k subscribers basically it's her and the shiba unu it's just it is what it is right i'm going to show you the linkedin uh these are two massive companies for small businesses where i live i live in a very small city called humble humble texas and it's just outside houston i would imagine that both of these two businesses are re relatively large and it's a little niche of the area i'm just tired uh, i want to do something more fun uh, one of the first things i am going to do is uh, go to sounds crazy i'm going to go to los angeles so someone who has been asking me to travel out there they, they paid they're going to pay for the plane ticket they're going to pay for everything and then even give me a stipend to do a podcast a very very large youtuber and watches and rolex i bet you you guys have no idea we do rolex talk in the other channel right no idea so um yeah we, i'm very very excited for uh that and i am definitely um no, i'm definitely quite excited to see um overall what that impact will be on my channel so it is a larger channel they they are a podcast channel most i can show you so they have like a 100k sub giveaway they're giving away a rolex uh out but that that's not like you know the biggest so they have 141k views 92k views 135k views 130k views 85k views and they are um yeah i mean uh, they got some pretty big names and they are doing really really great in my opinion so we'll see how that uh comes out right so anyway back to the initial thing uh and they've already paid me so i'm going to go i'm going to go i think i want to spend definitely more time on definitely more time enjoying stuff i like like you know, and it's not just magic and Pokemon. I, I got to sell this shit because I got, it just takes up so much room and it would be a full-time job to sell it. Now I have tried in the past, I've paid $5,000 for a manager at a larger card shop to come here and try to live stream and sell stuff and see completely failed. I was $5,000 down the drain where honest to God, it was just uh, the biggest like you know, wasted money, again, promises and so on. And I, I don't know, I, I was like, okay, well, you, you gave your best, it just kind of happened. Like at the end of the day, like you have to sell it yourself because you're the only one, you bought it, you know what price you bought it, you know what price you want to sell it. Um, it's all up to you. There's no one else who can do this to you. Also, I'm going to work on my Umu channel a little bit more in the coming days to try to get more traffic. My goal is uh, I'm definitely taking off uh, financially, I'm very well off. And I'll just leave it there. I've already gone over some financial details. Uh, I could not work for 15 years and still have money. 
probably 20 years. Yeah, I could not work for 20 years and still be able to live the lifestyle I have today, be able to support Farina. And um, yeah, we have I have something called passive income. I'm not going to go into too much detail about what my passive income is, but it is... I mean, you have a base, right? You have a, a base. And these are my other two channels. Feel free to subscribe to them. One of them is a baby channel. Yes, where I just post about my baby in my Shiba Unu. It's only a short channel. Um, that one is the only one that's not 30,000. But again, I just had a baby. So that one is ramping up quite quickly and very nicely right now. So I'll be at 30,000 in no time. So yeah, that's my plan. I mean, my plan is basically... Number one, you know, it sounds really crazy, but I used to be 165 pounds. I went up to 195 pounds due to stress eating and ordering out, takeout, and all this stuff. Now I'm down to like 175. I want to get down to 165. Um, depending on the time of day, it may could be 180. So I need to get down to 165. 160. So I need to lose another 20 pounds, which is quite difficult. I bought a bicycle. I bought a bicycle, I have a walking pad, I have no excuse not to lose this weight at this point in time, and now I have the time to exercise, now be taking care of a baby, I am the primary caregiver, so I spend 14 to 18 hours taking care of my daughter, and that's just kind of, you know, I wanted the daughter, I wanted the child, um, the mom was, you know, you know, obviously happy to have a child, but um, it was mainly from my direction, is I wanted to go on that, new, I had saved money, I paid all the hospital bills, all the child bills, like I, everything, right? Everything went through my accounts because I have the money. And uh, yeah, so I wanted a child and, and maybe we'll want two childs. And the one thing preventing us from having a second child is obviously my magic and Pokemon cards because they are literally plastered. I think I have a video of it, but that doesn't even show like how bad it is. Because like I have tables where I just put the stuff on the tables and they just leave it on the table. Like, they're, like, buckling onto the pressure of ETBs. That's how high I have it stacked. I am ready to kind of move on. Uh, I will always love Pokemon. I think my kids will always love Pokemon. Um, but I'm ready to move on from a lot of this stuff. Uh, because, in my opinion, it's mainly garbage. 95% um, of a booster box is cards you don't want. And unfortunately, the price of the booster box in the hunt, you're never going to break even on the box. And I, I, I get it, man. I, I get it. I, you don't need to tell me. I've been playing this game for a very, very long time. Um, yeah, I am 100% ready to move on and have a second. I'd much rather have a second child than... So that's what my focus is on, you know, being a good dad. 